We're starting to see prices increase here in West Michigan as well. That trend was already happening because of the demand for gas as families begin traveling again coming out of the pandemic. Here's 13 on your side, Lakeshore reporter John Mills. The national price of gas was already climbing and just a penny under the $3 mark. Here in the Muskegon area, regular unleaded is between 288 and 290 a gallon. The cyber attack on the Colonial Pipeline wasn't expected to cause a price increase in West Michigan, but the longer the pipeline is shut down, it could trigger an increase in local prices. Gas Buddy spokesman Patrick DeHaan says demand for gasoline is increasing coming out of COVID, and that's why prices here were climbing. Travel in 2021 is expected to be significantly higher when compared to last year. DeHaan thinks in West Michigan, summer prices will top out at 319 per gallon. That's the high price in the summer of 2018. The Colonial Pipeline also shut down in 2016. DeHaan says back then it was only the line that delivered gasoline. This time it's the whole shebang. It's four pipelines that make up the Colonial system that are shut down. They carry gasoline, diesel and jet fuel. Pipeline companies like Wolverine Pipeline that operates in West Michigan are carefully watching this and, and certainly will learn a thing or two. Uh, but this can affect all lines of businesses, whether it's pipeline companies or utilities. Uh, very distinct situation, very much different in Grand Rapids than it will be uh, in the southeast. The Colonial Line does not serve Michigan, and the refineries that produce gas for this area are not affected. However, another price driver is about to happen. That's Memorial Day. AAA predicts 34 million Americans will travel by car over the long holiday weekend, driving up demand for gas and prices in every U.S. market. In Muskegon, John Mills, 13 on your side.